What's going on guys? My name is Lane and welcome back to the Saquon Barkley career mode. Last episode we beat the Bengals 17-9 but then we played against the Dallas Cowboys and Irons just forgot how to play. We ended up losing that game 17-12 but this episode we're playing against the 8-2 Steelers and then we're playing the Dallas Cowboys again so let's hop right in. This is going to be a tough game. They still have Big Ben, they still have Le'Veon Bell, they still have Antonio Brown who all might not be on the Steelers next season but let's start this off with a run. They already put up three points. We're getting some nice blocks downfield. We're going to get tackled by two guys. It is 3-0. But you got to admit, that was a great run to start off the game. Now, I hope we can win this game and then beat the Steelers because I don't know if the Redskins won or lost last week. Oh, I did not hit X. I hit A by accident. Oh, they have Ryan Shazier. Of course, of course. We have a second and two. We're going to get the two yards, but not much more. Shay's there to make the tackle again. I wish I was talking over that last play. I was just blocking because Iron just got hit really hard trying to scramble. It was the strangest play. We are going absolutely nowhere. I'm going to have to learn to just pick plays that Engram's not going across the middle. It's kind of like a safety blanket. I kind of have some separation. I have a really, really bad feeling. After last video, where Iron just forgot how to play, that's the kind of thing he was doing. I hope at 8 2 we don't somehow miss the playoffs. Oh, we're off. We're off to the races. One guy to beat, but then they come off the screen and get me. Maybe I'm depending too much last week and then at the beginning of this week. Maybe we just got to pound that run. And then we can get some play action fakes. Got the block. We're just going to keep running, 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 unless we have to do something else. There we go. I'm truck sticking this guy. Really? I've been upping his truck stick too, his power run, whatever you want to call it. Now, here's where we mix in a little bit of a pass. I am going to go on this pass. It looks like they're going to blitz us. Oh, no, they're dropping back. All right. Of course. Oh, that's not even Engram. It is a tight end, though. We're running the China Special. Not really sure why it's called that. I did not mean to go in motion. I'm going to make that block for you, Shepard. Come on. Stop trying to be fancy. A great play before the two-minute warning. We have a first and 10 on the 13. We are doing a screen pass. They're not good. Oh, I still actually caught that. I was not expecting that. I kind of put my controller down like an idiot. Let's see what they can do on the double-triple slant. We are just blocking on this, but I'm going to make sure they can score a touchdown. Get in there, touchdown. Really? Stopped at the one. It looked like he fell in. Here's our chance. I believe this will be our 10th touchdown on the year. We do not have a goal. It was a goal last drive. I'm not sure why it isn't right now. We're going right side. Let's get in there. Stop trying to be fancy for no reason. We're trying to get on second down. No questions asked. Nope, we're not getting in. We're trying the double, triple slants again. I am just blocking, but you guys asked to see all the touchdowns if you could, so here we go. That is actually going to work. Touchdown, Evan Engram, to take the lead, 7-3. I completely forgot that we got the ball after halftime, so it is 7-3. We are in good position right now. Did we fumble it? What was that? Lucky 56. Lucky 56. Let's see what we can do. Oh, wide open Odell Beckham. And that is going to be a touchdown. 75-yard touchdown. We're going to have an 11-point lead. They scored a touchdown and went for two already. So it is 14 to 11 with 322 left. I was holding back. He should have got his balance back. But we're also in the driver's seat, so I can just run, run. If we get to third down, we pass it. Hopefully, you get the first down. Waste at least the rest of the third quarter. I'm cutting left. There we go. Another first down. Easy. We've done 14 rushing plays. Only six passing plays? And Irons has two touchdowns? Really? Let's go outside. Wow, the juke's working this game. Still on our feet. 
fighting for that first down. We are over 100 yards. Now we're going to mix in some passing plays. Six passing plays. Really not a lot. Angram. No, that's not Angram. That's our fullback. I was going to say. That wasn't a great first down play call. I'll be honest. We need a score here. Because 17-11, that's not good against Antonio Brown. Le'Veon Bell. I have to imagine Juju Smith-Schuster. Okay, we got the first down. That's good. Keep that clock turning. This should be the final play of the third quarter. And we're already in field goal range. We're going to hop outside. Ooh, got tackled by 23. Is that Burns? Beginning of the fourth quarter. Second and five. What is that run defense going to stop us now? 17 rushes, 120 yards. Not bad. Not exactly what I would have called. We have a third and three. We're going to run to the right side. Hopefully our fullback can lead the way. Ingram can hold this block for once. Oh, that's going to be enough for the first down. And a touchdown to take the lead 21 to 11. I love it. Tenth rushing touchdown of the season. They turned it over. Ball game. We are on the 19. How much easier could it get? I suppose a little bit closer, but, you know. Let's just keep wasting that clock down. We're going to get a field goal after this play, unless we get a first down somehow, third and eight. So we'll be up 24 to 11. No chance. That is the game. I am just going to run the rest of the clock out. I assume they're going to waste their timeouts and drag this out. I'll see you in a second. We won the game 24 to 11. They had 259 passing yards to our 107. We had 148 rushing yards to their 77, and we had the one takeaway. So let's take a look at the stats. Roethlisberger, 18 for 36, 259 with an interception, a 62 rating. Wow. Irons only threw seven passes, six for seven, 115, two touchdowns, a perfect passer rating. Barkley, 22 rushes, 151 with a touchdown. Bell, 12 for 77 with a touchdown. Receiving. Martel Dorsett, 6 for 101. Obviously a rookie they put in the game. Antonio Brown, 6 for 88. McDonald, 3 for 37. Beckham, 2 for 85 with a touchdown. Engram, 1 for 4 with a touchdown. But let's hop into the next game against the Dallas Cowboys. The Cowboys are 3 and 8. And one of their victories is over our team. So hopefully playing at home this time, we can beat Dak Prescott. We can beat Ezekiel Elliott. We can beat their defense. It shouldn't be too much of a problem. But maybe it's going to be. I totally said I wouldn't call this play anymore, but I did by accident. He's going to go to Angram across the middle. Oh, my God. He did it. Surprise, surprise. This is not the way we want to start off this game. We also have to look down below, see if we can see what the Redskins uh, record is. So we're doing a screen pass. Are you serious? Are you serious? What on earth was that? Yet somehow they only get away with three points. I was so open. And he just took his pleasant ass time. First and ten. They're getting some nice blocks downfield. Oh no. I might have been able to take off. That's a nice block we're getting right there. I, I did it again. I did it again. Come on. I had the room to just take off down the sideline. But I just don't trust my blockers whatsoever. Not a bad game. If we're being fair. We're about to be in field goal range though. So that's good. Ah, oh, we might have leaned forward. That was two yards. But I think it's going to be inches. Of course it is. And I just saw the Redskins are seven and four. And we're 9-2 and two at the moment. So if we win this, I think we clinch at least the playoffs. That's a nice block. Juke move. Come on, what are you... Stop focusing on a guy and running backwards. It doesn't make sense. The most aggravating thing. The gameplay in this game is just so not fun. I don't know. There's no other way to put it. That's a nice play. Trucking down to about the seven, the eight yard line. First and goal. This should be the final play of the first quarter. Can we score a rushing touchdown? 
Let's get around that edge. Let's score a touchdown with Barkley to take the lead. Seven to three. What's the signature dance? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's actually Elliot's. He's on the other team, but I like the taunting. I can definitely approve of that. All right. We have a back and forth game right now. It is 10 to seven. About five minutes left in the half. He, I, I, I don't know. I don't know why I call a play when Engram was going across the middle. Every time I do it, he throws it to him. There might as well be no one else on the field if we're being fair. We're actually getting the blocks we need. This is great. This is absolutely great. We have seven rushes, 72 yards. There's honestly nothing better when my offense is running like this. Even that, that's not a bad game. We have a second and six. Three minutes left. Oh, I ran the wrong way. My bad. Don't know why you would throw it into that kind of coverage. But Sterling Shepard's going to fight for that first down, and I absolutely love it. We're going to leave them not much time, to be fair. I don't really know what's going on right there. We just hit that two-minute warning. I do not want to change the pass protection right now. Yes, there we go. Down to the 10-yard line. Big, big gain. Iron's playing great this game. He's definitely making up for last time we played the Cowboys. So we have a first and 10 on the 10-yard line. Some might say that's first and goal, but whatever. Get by him. No, 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 no. Really? Really? What is going on? How did my guy get it? What just happened right there? A booth review. I don't think I was down that time. Let's find out. Overturned. Works for me. Definitely thought he was down, and then everyone just dove at it. Really made no sense. Yeah, we're not going to be able to get a rushing touchdown here. I'm going to have to leave it up to Irons. I called a play where Romero's not going that far. I just have a feeling he's going to throw it directly to him. No, but instead, a nice interception. Unbelievable. We're in field goal range. They turned the ball over, so that is good. We have all three of our timeouts. I doubt we're going to score a touchdown. A nice game. Let's call it timeout. We have a second and three with 18 seconds left. Oh, I'm getting way stuck behind the line. Big game by Sterling Shepard. Let's call that timeout. Best case scenario, it's 14 to 10 at halftime. Worst case scenario, other than throwing an interception, tie ball game. I'll take that. Swatted. We are running the same exact play. Probably not the best idea. Let's make our block. Same exact guy swatted it down. We have one final chance before we just kick that field goal and tie the ball game up. Basically the same play, but not exactly the same play. He almost threw an interception again. That would have been his third on the day. 13 to 10, 4 11 left in the third quarter. I love back and forth games. I don't want blowouts either way. I want it to be interesting. Wow. I don't know if I'd call a running play right here. I typically do what they suggest just to keep it somewhat realistic. Man, we're not really going anywhere. Because, I mean, obviously, if the running back was calling all the plays, it'd be run, 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 no matter what. You, I mean, some passes, maybe they'll pass to the running back, you know. He's actually going to run and get that first down. Well done. We're going left side. Lead the way. No, really? Is that Woods? I just picked another play that Engram goes across the middle. What am I thinking? Oh, my God, he threw it to Ingram. If you gave me a million guesses, I never would have guessed that. This is more like it. Four verticals. He's just going straight. Hopefully, we can get open. I'm just going to try to get to the first down marker. Of course, he's not going to throw it to me. He's going to get sacked. Wow. But then they turn it over. We're on the 23-yard line with 38 seconds left in the third quarter. Our offensive line, where did it go? It looked great in the first half. 
Beginning of the fourth quarter, second and 11. That is another interception. What are you doing? We're going to lose to the Cowboys twice, and they're a terrible team. We're still in this game. It's 16 to 10, 2.35 left, and we have all of our timeouts. The running game's not going to work. We're going to have to throw it. Two minutes left to go 74 yards and score a touchdown. We have all of our timeouts, so we're in good shape. We're doing a screen pass. Okay, he's going to hit us. We're going to get behind our blockers. But we ran right into our blockers. Not exactly what we wanted to do. Now, yes, I am calling a play where Engram just goes across the first out marker. Because, I mean, he's going to throw it to him. Let's be fair. I told you. First down. Calling the timeout. First and 10 with a minute 36 left. That's going to be a great play. And he got out of bounds, I believe. Yes, he's waving it off. I do have a bad feeling we're going to get down to probably like the five-yard line. And we're not going to be able to score. How more open could I get? Thank you. Oh, could not catch it. Let's just make some smart plays, Irons. That's good. That is a first down. We're going to have to run the hurry up a little bit. Not every single time. We're doing a play action burst. I think that's what they called it. That's actually going to work. And he got out of bounds. A booth review. There's no way they overturned this. Yes. Thank you. I was very, very concerned. There's a minute five left. I should probably run the ball even though they'd call a timeout in theory. But let's just try to get in there. Cutting it back. Touchdown. Evan Ingram. Hopefully to take the lead. I'm going to bring you guys along. Let's see what they do. He should get the extra point. He did. 57 seconds left. Let's see what they can do. Really? They just got into field goal range. I'm not sure if we won or we lost. We won the game 17-16. Let's take a look at the stats. Dak Prescott, 19 for 29, 221, no touchdowns, two interceptions. Irons, 15 for 22, 168, a touchdown and three interceptions. He had a terrible, terrible game. Elliott, 17 for 80 with a touchdown. Barkley, 16 for 87 with a touchdown. We had a great first half. Wayne, 8 for 79. Engram, 7 for 65 with a touchdown. Hearns, 5 for 92. Barkley, 3 for 41. Shepard, 3 for 41. Hernandez, 3 for 26. Anything else, not really. Beckham, 2 for 21. But that is going to do it for this video. So if you liked the video, give it a like down below. Make sure to check out my channel. Subscribe for more content. And I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.